kind of wish you had a Santa hat on right now. They have beard lights that you can like deck your beard out, but you don't really have like a beard beard. I could grow one. That would be funny. Today we are going to be doing a men's gift guide for the holidays. And my husband is joining us today because I want him to show you guys what he would like to receive from a guy's point of view. So I think sometimes when women give gifts, we always think of like what we would like to have, like clothes and all that kind of stuff. So I wanted him to talk about gifts that he would like to receive, um, things that he has used over the past year or two that he's actually getting a lot of use out of, and things that he's really loving. So we're just going to kind of go through some stuff that he's been loving throughout the years, um, or you know, some things that he would love to receive this year. So first of all, we are going to talk about shoes, and I know that most men really like shoes, right? I mean, yes. shoes is a really good gift to give guys. However, they're probably really picky when it comes to their shoes, just like any Anybody really but we have some extremely good like amazing quality shoes that we want to show you guys and these are called greats and today's video is actually sponsored by greats um, but I mean really you love these shoes yeah you know I, I really like the colors gray uh, is you know such a neutral color for me so uh, in San Antonio it rarely gets super cold so I can wear these um, in the springtime I can wear these in the fall uh, right now so just super premium leather, like they feel super comfortable. Um, I've never really owned a very expensive pair of what I would consider like a These casual are probably style. The best quality shoe that you have ever had in your life. Yes. I mean, the, you can smell the leather when you pick them yeah. up. Um, they are just. They are so nice. I don't think that you could go wrong with these shoes. They have a bunch of different styles. The quality is like out of this world. So um, as you can see, like the inside here, like look at the, the leather. I mean, these are some sturdy shoes. Even the box that they came in was like extremely high quality. And they are gonna be having a huge Black Friday sale on these. So you guys need to jump on these if your husband is wanting some really casual shoes that he can get a lot of wear out of. I mean, he's probably going to have these for many, many years. Um, you could really just like wipe these off uh, because of the, the leather on the outside. So these are going to last him so long. He can wear these with jeans, shorts, any time of the year, whether it's the winter, the summer, anything. So he's going to get so much wear out of these. And I, I mean, I actually got a pair for myself. And I mean, this is a men's gift guide, so I'm not gonna show you guys yet, but definitely check out Greats. I'm gonna have the link in the description box below. If you are looking for shoes or just a really unique and different gift for your husband, these, or boyfriend, or significant other, these are some amazing quality shoes. So definitely check out the link below and um, check out their Black Friday sale. It is going to be so good and you guys are gonna get such a good deal on these shoes. Okay, so another thing that he gets use out of every single day are Bose noise canceling headphones. And he actually bought me some, um, I don't know if it was for Christmas or anniversary or something like that last year, but I use mine almost every day. So these things are amazing. So I use them uh, just kind of block out the world. I use them when I work, so it helps me concentrate and focus on what I'm doing so that I can be productive. Um, See, he had ordered me, what was the pair that you got me before the bows that we got that didn't work? The Beats. Uh, Beats, yes. He had ordered me a pair of Beats and I was really excited and then I got them and they didn't work. And we have had no issues with the Bose headphones. So I would highly recommend them from my standpoint. He uses them for work every single day. Um, and these are the Bluetooth ones, right? Yep. Okay, so he has Bluetooth. I have the ones with the um, plug-in, so you can plug it into your computer. Um, but he's got the Bluetooth ones. You could really, you could like work out with those, right? Yes, a lot um, of people work out with these. They're really comfortable. You can use them in the car. Um, I actually used those when, yeah, when he was snoring one night. <laughs> I put the noise canceling thing on and I actually couldn't hear you snoring. <laughs> these are over ear headphones. They have on ear, over ear, so these actually wrap around your ears. They're, I think they're more comfortable than an on ear headphone. Um, and so you so recommend the over ear ones? I recommend over ear rather than on ear headphones. If you have uh, someone that uh, is very athletic, likes to run, and doesn't want the bulk, they do have the bows in ear, uh, which kind of wrap around the ears, so those may be better if your husband is a runner or 
uh, is very active, mobile, but I wear these when I cut the grass. Mm -hmm. I wear these when I work. I mean, I wear these all the I time. I think those actually make you cut the grass more because you get to go outside and listen to your podcast or whatever and listen to your headphones. So he gets literally use of these yep. every single day and so do I. I use mine all the time. So that is a wonderful gift. I'm going to leave all of these links below in case you guys are interested in ordering. Um, everything will be below if you want to get them for gifts for your husband, boyfriend, whoever. So, so the next thing is portable speakers. We each have one as you can see here. Um, one is a little bit bulkier than the other one so it just kind of depends on like what your significant other is going to be using them for. I like to keep mine in the house so if I'm cleaning um, just throughout the day like I'm probably going to start playing some Christmas music on mine pretty soon and the quality of these is so good. I've had mine since we were dating I think. You got this for me. Got this, this, yeah. This was a great gift. He came up with this on his own and obviously it is still like working in perfect condition. So this is um, a Bluetooth speaker. I don't know if I said that already. This one is by Sound Freak, um, but it's just really, I mean, it's like white and it just looks really nice. It kind of blends in with like my home decor. Um, I'm sure that your husband is probably not really gonna care about that. So his is actually a little bit more portable. So he could take his like to the golf course, right? You mm -hmm. could like put it in like the golf cart. So I bought this because my, my car is a little older um, and does not have Bluetooth stereo so this actually fits in the cup holder if your husband plays golf he can take this put it in the cup holder of the golf cart and it's great you can play low music on the golf court um, I just I, it has really good sound quality uh, for being such a small thing I've used this in baseball lessons you know we don't have uh, you know the speakers going on or I wanted something different than what was playing overhead I would just kind of put this down low so um, you can use it outside, you can use it indoors. Yeah, if you were like camping or fishing or any kind of activity that your husband does and wants music like louder than what his phone can play, this is perfect. And I mean, this is a pretty reasonable price, right? 20 bucks. Yeah. I mean, you can get, and so what is that one called? Is that a... This is Jam. It's a Jam. I forget what it's called. Okay. But, um... So we'll link both of these yeah. below in case you guys, um, like if he wants to put this, if he wants a little bit more of like a, not really... I mean, what's the difference? Would this be any louder than that one? Yeah, this think? one's a little bit bigger. It has a little bit bigger speaker. Um, but, I strategically bought this one because most speakers you buy are black, solid black. <laughs> so I wanted something that wouldn't be an ice we're in the house. Right. So um, if he's wanting it to be a little bit more portable, taking it around like to sports things, um, if he like coaches his kids, whatnot, like all that kind of stuff. Um, this one is probably definitely the way to go, but either one entertaining they, like you want something for outside Yeah, this would be great small. for like if you're having barbecues outside this one probably would be better than that one So I'm gonna leave both of them below you can make your choice on that But we highly recommend both of these brands. So another really good gift is sunglasses and who doesn't wear sunglasses and I know it can be a little bit difficult to pick out sunglasses for your husband um, or boyfriend I know it's kind of hard for me so we are actually gonna leave below some sunglass recommend recommendations that he recommends um, he has had you usually wear Oakley's right I do okay I so Oakley's. that's probably because he's always on the field coaching um, but they're also really good for like working out anything outdoors yeah. So what I would recommend is if you have a, your, your boyfriend or your husband is athletic or spends a lot of time outside, what you're looking for is something that's very light um, and you're going to look for something that doesn't have contact specifically to the face. So what you're looking for is a little bit of space. You can see that these have spacers so it's not stuck and close to your eyes when you're sweating, when it's really hot outside. Are really really light. You want something that's really light. So these are Oakley's which I'd recommend for any sport if your husband plays golf, um, you know, is out, outside or in the heat a lot. These are going to be great for when he's sweating. There's also a lot of ventilation um, with these. Maui Gym is another uh, brand which makes super light sunglasses for sports. Hmm. And if you were looking for sunglasses for somebody hmm. who's not necessarily looking for the sporty brand, I would just simply suggest staying with the stuff that's really traditional, like aviators from Ray-Bans, mm -hmm. you know, the uh, just your, your traditional frames that look good no matter like what face shape or what have you. Just like the classics if you're going to buy it for your husband and you don't know what style they like. So, all right. So I think for me this is a really valuable stocking stuffer. Um, I use this all the time. Um, so this is just a portable charger. I got this at Walmart. 
I got it in the checkout aisle. It was 10 bucks. It gives you a little display to tell you how much power it's got, but that's really nice to have the display. Yes. Right the display is key. So you can see it shows you <clears throat> click it on there. When it plugs in, it just stays stays on, but it shows you it's got 72% power. So this can power up my iPhone from dead all the way to full when I'm running around. So I keep this in my backpack when I'm out coaching. You know, it's hard to find an outlet, so um, it's key for me to just keep my phone charged. 10 bucks, it's so useful, and that's just a stocking stuffer like. I think that one's really nice because when you have like, I've actually had a couple of those portable charger things, but they don't tell you how much charge is left. So you go to plug your phone in and it's dead, but you had no idea yeah. um, how much is left. So that way you know like, hey, I need to plug this in tonight. And I'm not diligent about plugging it in every single night or whatever. So I assume that there's some power left in it and then I get to it and it's dead. So um, we're gonna link below. We're gonna see if we can find this exact one. We'll link it below. If not, um, we will link a very similar one down below but that's a really good stocking stuffer that's gonna get so much use so another thing that I use all the time it's you know the man's purse it's my backpack right so you know I use a backpack this Your is an Oakley pack. yes <laughs> so this is an Oakley it's a really heavy-duty backpack so you know it's got a lot of protection a lot of padding in here so what I'm carrying around is a lot of technology I've got my uh, MacBook that I take in here iPads, I put my iPhone in here, it's got a sunglass case on the top. Oh, that's really cool. I didn't know that was a mm -hmm. sunglass case. Yep, so it's a protective sunglass uh, case, so I put them in here and it keeps yeah. protected yeah. Oakley because it's a sunglass brand. It's just really heavy duty, it's really solid, it's kind of manly, so, you know, you that's always cool. for a long time, like this thing has, yeah. with, like, it's like army grade. <laughs> yes, and that's, I think that's kind of the uh, idea or the mindset is that it's kind of military grade uh, stuff, so. You know, it's a little bit on the higher price uh, range, but it's just the quality lasts. If you buy a, you know, a Sport backpack or something uh, that's cheaper, it's just not going to last as long. So I've literally had this for three or four uh, years yeah, now. Quite a few years. Um, the styles have just updated a little bit, but the quality is really nice. So I would recommend this. He's, he uses this thing every day, and it's been through a lot. Yeah. <laughs> So we'll link that below, um, but I would highly recommend that. he It's its his man purse. It's really cute. <laughs> so I wanted to mention a few things. I always do these for him. Not um, always like for Christmas, but any gift giving like holiday throughout the year. These are some really inexpensive ways. If you are really on a budget or if your husband really likes a little bit more personal gifts, I particularly love to give personal gifts. So you could also put these in stockings, um, but I will link the ones that I find below. But this one is, is called What I Love About Us. And it's just a little book that you go through and you kind of fill in the blanks. And it says, um, like for example, um, I love how good we are at giving each other. Well, that was a weird one. <laughs> okay, so like this one says, we make the best blank and then you would fill that in so it's just got a bunch of like little fill-in things but it's really cute and i mean you enjoy like yeah, personal it's, gifts like that too right I, you know it's it's from the heart so it means a lot so. <laughs> um and then this one is uh called what i like about you and it's kind of the same but it's a little bit more like about him so my favorite thing to do together is and then it gives you like this whole space to write in um, and these are just really fun things. Like he, he's gonna keep these. I well, I hope they are keep keepsakes. Them forever. <laughs> well, that's what you have. Yeah. And then um, this one is a little bit more PG thirteen ish, but um, this is <laughs> these are called sex checks. Okay, but a little bit more than PG thirteen. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure that we're all adults here. I would assume. Um, but things like these, not necessarily. They don't have to be like this, but um, coupons and stuff like that for massages or dates or I mean, these are probably a little bit more risque but um, I'm gonna link some of these below but these are really good gifts and I mean you know it's I think it's fun to give your spouse something like this you could even include like some lingerie with this or something right it's I fun mean. to receive a gift like this <laughs> I mean if your husband has everything he's not gonna turn this down it's <laughs> led to at least one of our kids so <laughs> if you're looking for something just completely out of the box your husband is not going to say no to this so some of these coupons and you know like a little santa lingerie or something i don't know you're not gonna i mean it's not a gift that you're gonna say no to so i always like the coupon book <laughs> okay and a couple little stocking stuffers that we had sitting around um this right here if you guys can see that this thing is 
amazing and literally so cheap we have had a couple of these just because everybody wants to use it at one time but hold on here oh <laughs> the first time it touches your skull it is a new experience you do it to me if you have somebody else do it on like if you do it to yourself it doesn't feel as good oh. <laughs> this is no joke oh yeah. my god it is something different if you have never tried one of these before do yourself a favor and order one for you or for your whether or not you're ordering it for yourself or your husband stick these in everybody's stocking and thank me later and then the last thing we're going to talk about is some underwear honey tell us about your underwear problems <laughs> in the past i have bought a lesser quality underwear uh you know whatever hanes i could get my hands on <laughs> and so you know my wife has turned me on to this which is a little fancy underwear and you know so the underwear i've had has a little tab in the back and it kind of scratches <laughs> your and it's you can't scratch your butt <laughs> in public so it's like the worst these are like amazing they feel great they're like butter on your butt so i'm a coach and i'm constantly on the field it's hot sweaty you know sweaty and these are great so these are called yeah. pair of thieves and if you haven't heard of them i think they have a few commercials like i don't where did you see them first um, because you were like honey i want a pair of those and i don't know if the commercial made them seem so amazing but i was like i think they sell those at target yeah so well, the next time that i was at target i picked some up for him and he was like these are so good and these pair are like they're almost silky like they're so light and silky i mean i can only imagine that they feel really good um but they are like your victoria's secret of men's underwear right <laughs> yeah base like we're looking for comfort and then of course you know my wife picked out the style right <laughs> i mean they have a bunch of really like you know cute but manly styles cute but manly. <laughs> They've got to do, like, they're different than just your solid underwear, which, you know, I, I don't think you really care, but I think it's cute when they have, like, little patterns. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, if you're looking for a good stocking stuffer, um, yeah, I mean, if your husband really has underwear with a bunch of holes in them and it's time to upgrade them, you might want to I get way more excited about getting a pack of underwear than I do a button-down shirt, which I know I'm going to get. <laughs> oh, just not saying. this year. Not if you said that. <laughs> I'm gonna fill your stocking up with some underwear. I will link those below if you are looking, I mean seriously, dead serious. I'm tired of listening to him talk about how his butt is itchy from his underwear. <laughs> Don't give the impression that I'm sitting here talking about how itchy my butt is all the time. I'm just simply saying when I have like, you know, you hang on to some older underwear because, you know, we don't necessarily mm -hmm. wash our stuff every single day. What? You don't wash your underwear No, I'm every saying day? we don't wash our clothes every single day, so sometimes I get down to the end of, you know, like oh, the underwear yeah. drawer, and I'm like, oh, like, I gotta put in the old scratchy ones on for a half hour. <laughs> it actually motivates me to do the laundry. Do yourself a favor and get your husband some non-scratchy underwear. <laughs> I always recommend upgrading technology. Your husband loves technology. He hasn't updated his phone. Just encourage him to go update his phone <laughs> as part um, of a another Christmas thing gift. that you could do um that you were saying that we obviously don't have like physically but tickets right yes i highly recommend experiences he loves experiences like stuff where we can actually go and do things and kind of make memories um so tickets to like a sports game if he loves like football like cowboys game or whatever basketball baseball uh, comedy, you know, we've gone movies. to... Movies, yeah. I mean, if there's like a movie that he's looking forward to, I think I got you like Star Wars tickets one year. Um, that was a big deal because I actually went with him and he enjoyed that. Um, but she enjoyed it too. If there's something that they're looking forward to, um, or tickets are a good way to kind of like drag out the Christmas present. So yeah. last year you got me Carrie Underwood tickets, yes. I think. And so I looked forward to using my Christmas present for like... You know, six months. It was like to in come. May. So yeah, yeah. So tickets are a really good idea if you're looking to give more of like an experience for um, really the both of you. You know, if you get two tickets and you can both go and enjoy that gift a little bit longer. So. 
So anyways, that is our men's gift guide video um, from a man himself. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out the link below for the great shoes. Your husband, boyfriend will absolutely love them. You will be able to keep the shoes for like years to come. They are a great casual shoe that, you can, that he can wear with pretty much anything. So we would highly recommend those. Check out the link below. They're going to be having a huge Black Friday sale. So don't forget that. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. And we will see you guys all in my next video. Bye.